let me show you something that is very, very powerful. See this? This is something you should have. This is a helping hand. A helping hand that always is looking for ways to reach out and touch someone to make their life better. It has been said, make it a rule and pray to God to help you keep it. Never, if possible, to lie down at night without being able to say, I have made at least one human being at least a little wiser, at least a little happier, at least a little better this day. In Luke 10, verse 33 and verse 34, it says, The Samaritan put the hurt man on his donkey and took him to an inn where he cared for him. Sometimes we would like to make the world a better place, but we're not exactly sure how to do it. Well, we wake up each day and we pray to God to show us the way, to show us how to help others. Jesus told the story of the Good Samaritan, a man who helped a fellow traveler when no one else would. He told this story to show that we too should lend a hand when we encounter people who need our help. When bad things happen in the world, there's always something that we can do. There is always something we need to pray to God for that something to be told to us so that we can go and, and do it. What can you do today to make the world a better place? Well, you can start by making your corner of the world a little happier by sharing kind words and sharing good deeds. And when you become aware of people's needs and you've done what you can to meet those needs, take those concerns to God in prayer. And then you've done all that you can do and then you release it to God to do all that God can do. Whether you've offered a helping hand or a heartfelt prayer, you have done a lot to make your world a better place.